Hi guys, it's me again. I'm back. Okay, I've got an Amazon box. Um, I did already open it just because, you know, I'm impatient and can't wait to actually open it up on video. Plus, these days, I never know what's actually coming because I don't know if it's supplies for the shop or if it's something that I bought because I can't help myself or what. Um... This is kind of a mix. This is something I bought because I can't help my shelf, <coughs> Rachel Ray. And um, another thing because I'm trying to find a better way for me to record videos. Um, I don't know how it is for you guys watching it, but I'm not liking you guys being at this angle. Um, it's kind of cumbersome the way I'm having to sit you up and still have you plugged into the charger. And I've only got so much room that I can move and all this. It's just not good. It's not good. I want to up my game a little bit. So, I did some online shopping. Surprise, surprise. So, in the box, we have, thanks to Rachel's video one of these bad boys my hope is that I can get this set up and having this many trays will allow me to work easier through my Chuck Pinson confetti so that I can finally finally get a bluebird song finished this year March of this year will make one whole calendar year 360 some days that I have had that as a whip and it's not been completed. It's time. I got to get it finished. So I'm thinking having multiple trays out in one time, I can sit it kind of over there as I'm working here on the diamond painting instead of being out there in the den where the dogs are because that, that would not happen. No, no. That would just be spilled drills everywhere. So... Rachel had a video she posted recently. I will try to link it below where she showed her unboxing of this. And she put it together off camera. Um, I'm not going to try to put it together on camera. But um, that way you can see the final product. It's really neat. It comes with these boats that are all the same size. There's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. There's 12 boats that it comes with, but I want to say, oh yeah, it's got 16 spots. This one is actually, it's from Santa Direct. I know we've heard their name before. They have all kinds of diamond painting accessories. It's got a 16 slots, but only 12 boats in there. But if you have the white Mosfa boat, or even some of the little green boats, probably they would fit. You see here, these holes in one end, that's for you to do, put like um, your pins or scissors or tweezers or something in. But you can put the boats on that side as well if you're not going to use those holes. And I, I'm not. So I will, I will, I don't have that many MOSFA boats, but maybe the, the clear DAC boats, something. I'll find something that works. Anyway, that's my plan for this bad boy. When I went to purchase it, it was like $17 or $18. A little bit more than it was when Rachel got hers. But that's what happens on Amazon. The prices change like in a blink of an eye. So you never know what it may be when you go to actually purchase something. But for me, it was worth it if that means I finish my Chuck Pinson. So that's that. And then the other thing I got <clears throat> to try to help my quality of videos, which yes, I know, I know, my uploading isn't very, um, what's the word? It's not very, um, reliable. It's not, uh, consistent. That's the word, consistent. English. It's not very consistent, but these days I really never know when I'm going to have time to record a video or even diamond paint. I haven't di actually diamond painted. It's probably been a couple of weeks now. I've just been too busy, you know, with work and home and the shop. I put those things first for the most part. Well, definitely the shop. The home stuff, not so much. Um, I don't put that first. I would put diamond painting before the home stuff. But you get what I'm saying? Like, I... I, I Anyway, so in my efforts to make better videos, I got one of these. I'm hoping that this squiggly bit, the part that actually is the bendy part where the foam clamp goes onto, I'm hoping it'll be more 
stable or firm. Um, hang on, let me show you this one. This little, this one, I used a couple of times. Is a cheapo. This is the one, I like this part. This is the clip that holds my phone. And then we got, it's nice. It's got a nice length to it. It's really long. And then this is the clamp that I would clamp it onto my table. But the problem is, by the time I put my phone up here, and it this the gravity takes its toll, like, it's too wobbly. Anytime I would bump the table or anything, the phone would shake really bad. And I didn't like it. So... That was a flop, but I'm not going to complain too much because it was an El Cheapo AliExpress. Anyway, uh, what my phone is on right now, it's a little, it's a little tripod one, just a little, you know, a little tripod holder thing from AliExpress again, a um, little El Cheapo thing, but you see the angle that you're at, so it, it just feels weird. So I was hoping with something like this, maybe... I could get you guys in like an overhead view or something. That was my hope anyway. So, actually when I went to, I got this off of Amazon. And what I typed in the search was Lazy Arm. And this is what came up. Uh, so we'll see. I don't know if it's technically a Lazy Arm or not. The brand name's uh, Lamacall. It just says Gooseneck Phone Holder. So, it doesn't look like there's really any assembly. Happy? Not happy. Happy? Not happy. We will see, card. We will see. So, let me get this out of the way. This is what we got. This is what it looks like coming out of the box. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah. See, this is, this is nice. It's nice and firm. Okay. I don't know how, how the height's going to do. However... This this bit is not wobbly, so I like it already. Let me get this. Y'all can't even see what I'm doing. Do you even care? I don't know. <laughs> Try to get this off the end. See, see, it's just I'm not making very good videos as far as well, I don't know if the content's good or not. I don't know. It is what it is. But as far as just the filming itself is what I'm talking about. I don't know if that's good. Okay, so, okay, how do I, how do I clamp it? Oh, okay, wait, that screws, all right. Oh, I see, okay, hold on. So, let's screw this up, all right. So, see how I screwed, screwed this piece open and that came out. So, now I can put my table here. All right, let me... Turn y'all around here and see. All right. So here's. Eh, we'll try it here, and if I have to move it, I can move it. It's not permanent. Okay. Well, look at that. Fast installation. Okay. So now let me. Oh yeah. Okay. All right. So that. Uh, hold on. I gotta stand up here. Y'all aren't seeing anything. I'm sorry. Look at the window. There's, that's the tri the first tripod I used to make any videos. That was actually the tripod that my grandmother used to paint on. Like she did oil paintings and stuff. Okay, so this. All right, let me see. You guys, this might be a winner. Okay, hold on. Uh, let's go for a ride. Hold on. Let me take you out of this one. Okay. See, there's there's the other cheapo AliExpress one. Let me um, put you up here. And... <gasps> Would you look at that? Oh, okay. You're still going to wobble if if I shake vigorously. Uh, this table doesn't see that much action, so it's okay. But it's not like if I just... Okay, well, yeah. You still move a little bit when I bump the table, but you're not directly overhead but you're more overhead than you were with with this with this one that I was using this flimsy thing like my phone would be like down to here because it weighed so much and I am about that's only about like like that far off the top of the table 
barely enough room for me to diamond paint underneath. Oh, you went out of focus. Oh, fo oh, focus. Okay. All right. So, yeah. Okay. So, it was a little bit more expensive. However, I am pleased with this. It's very sturdy. So, I like it. It was worth it. If I can, I will link it down below. Um, but again, the brand name is Lamacall. So, let me see. Right there. It's a QR thing. I don't know if you got the QR scan or maybe if you scan that, it'll take you to it. But there's the name right there, Lamacall. But again, on, um, oh look, I guess they got all kinds of social media. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest. Oh, oh. What am I trying to do? Oh, it's trying to turn my phone off. I was on the power button. Okay, that's one thing I'm going to have to remember when I put it in here. Sorry, guys. Okay. Uh, what was I saying? So, anyway, yeah, they got social media. But, yeah, just go to Amazon, type in Lazy Arm, and this one will come up. Um, I want to say it was maybe about, uh, well, you know what? Hang on. I have a laptop now. I can pull it up online to see what I paid for it. Goodness. If the laptop will come on. Oh, disconnected from the internet. Let me connect back. So I really want to now be able to figure out how I can use my phone as a webcam to be able to do a live stream. That. That's a goal I have. So if anybody knows and is willing to help me out, that'd be cool. Um, get signed into the Amazon. Uh, okay. Um, it was eighteen sixty nine. So, extremely reasonable for as good of a product as it is. I highly recommend it. Um, this actually did have a good rating. It almost had five stars. It's not a full five stars. It's like four and a half stars. But that's out of over 13,000 ratings, you know. So, uh, And they had one that's actually where the, the bendy part is rose gold. But that one was $22. So I just went for the all black one instead. But, um, yeah, I absolutely love it. Yep, just look up Lazy Arm. Well, it says phone holder, phone holder bed, gooseneck mount, lama call, cell phone clamp clip for desk, flexible lazy arm, headboard bedside, overhead mount stand, compatible with phone 12 mini 11 pro XS. I guess that's naming all the different phones that would fit in it. Um, the one I'm using, it's a Gal Samsung Galaxy something. It's an older one, so it's not the biggest one. But, um, okay, now down here it's saying there's a newer model of this item. Um, I don't know what the difference is, but it's $34. Maybe the neck part is higher? I don't know, but I'm happy with this one. Eighteen sixty nine, totally worth it. Great investment. I'm happy with my purchase. All right, so that's it for this video. Just my little enablement order from, you know, seeing somebody else order something. I just had to get it. And then my phone stand to try to make better quality videos for everyone. So I'm going to get this cleaned up and I will be doing an unboxing video next now that I have a better recording angle. So yay! Thanks everybody for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.